More than 37 years now, Pride Houston has been a central part of the local LGBT community in Houston. And tomorrow, the fourth largest Pride celebration kicks off downtown. Our Sophia Beausoleil live with Look Ahead at the big festival and the big parade. Hi, Sophia. Hi, good evening. Well, you know, a lot of people from Houston and across the nation will be here to celebrate the LGBTQ community. And I want you to take a look at this. We're at the corner of Taft and Westheimer. And Pride Houston put this crosswalk up, this rainbow crosswalk up, about a week ago, just in time for all the big festivities, which will actually be happening downtown. Now, take a look at your screen. Leading the parade will be this Houston police squad car with these temporary rainbow decals. HPD told us that it was supposed to be a surprise, but a picture made its way to Outsmart magazine. Now, this is the 39th year of the Houston Pride Festival and Parade. And this year's theme is Wonderland. The festival starts at noon tomorrow near the city Houston Hall. And Leanne Rhymes will be performing at 3 o'clock. Then once the sun starts to go down, the parade will begin at 8.30 at Smith and Lamar and will end at Milam Street and Jefferson Street. Now more than 20, 250,000 people are expected to show up for all the festivities. And the city of Houston moved the parade from Montrose to downtown several years ago because of the growing crowds. We have much more room to breathe, let that parade breathe, and also more people to attend. And uh, we can expand that route uh, when we need to, but it's just a much more comfortable route and a safer route. All the colors, all the different people. I love seeing the people yeah. there, they go all out. There's a lot of excitement given all the festivities this weekend. Now the parade will end at 11 o'clock. When it comes to parking, the open garages will be there, but organizers are urging people to use either Uber, Lyft, or get a cab to go downtown. Reporting live from Montrose, Sophia Boslake, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right, hope they bring their water bottles. It's going to be a hot one. Oh, man, terribly hot. Thank you, Sophia.